Sanlam came at Tepe Cup made its way to Beaufort West in the central Karoo for the last stop on the tour of the country for the Western Cape Regional Finals. The top soccer schools from all over the province gathered for a day of enthralling action and the chance to be crowned champions of the Western Cape. The Sanlam Kemotepe Schools Cup uh, is the biggest sponsored school um, soccer tournament, not only in South Africa, but in Africa as well. Uh, it is named after the late mother of uh, Patrice Motepe. There are three partners. It is Sanlam, uh, the Motepe Foundation and Ubuntu Boto Community Development Trust. We've had exciting soccer. There's 18 teams that's going to participate at the national finals. We're very keen to see the talent that's going to be there. The six exciting teams were divided into two groups of three and took to the field. It's a joyous occasion having this tournament, specifically the youth in our, in our midst, in this area. This stuff is part of the 2010 football, football legacy. And you can see uh, we're having a nice stadium. We're having, having a nice turf. Uh, bringing all people together and in so doing combat, combat crime via, via sports. There was an abundance of raw talent on display and who knows where the next Benny McCarthy, Stephen Pinar or Aaron McQuenna might be discovered. Oh, plenty of talent in the country. Huh? The future of the country lies with the, with the youth. Huh? Without youth tournaments, we are doomed as a nation. Huh? The fun of our fun will always be struggling. But with such, with, with such tournaments, I still think the sky's the limit. I think I see the future for Bafana Bafana and the country's older. Because that is what we need. We need young, young players uh, to play in our national squad uh, and not over-age players that we have at the moment, unfortunately. Beaufort West School Bastianza enjoyed some vocal support from the home crowd to finish in fourth place overall, going down to Kaiya from Overberg in the battle for third spot. However, it was Klutersville from the Cape Windlands and Steenberg from Cape Town who progressed to the final. We were also uh, provincial champs in 2008 and 2010. But this year I'm extremely proud because we have only one boy that is, is turning 19 this year. So we've got a relatively green squad here and that makes me even more proud. I just said they need us to focus, know exactly what our mission was and what we were, what were our mission here to do here today. Strength is the midfield. We have an extremely good goalkeeper, very tall, so he will, he will do it for us today. The final was tightly contested with neither side willing to give an inch. Goal scoring opportunities were few and far between as both defences were watertight and much of the play was in the midfield. When a long ball approach was adopted, there were one or two chances, but in the pressure of a final, neither team's strikers were able to compose themselves to find the back of the net. Extra time came and went without any major drama, and it would take a penalty shootout to separate the teams. The spot kicks tested the nerves of both strikers and goalkeepers alike. Steenberg's tall gloveman was the standout and his agility proved to be the difference between the two teams. Both sides move on to the national finals to be held in Bloemfontein at the beginning of October. But it is Steenberg who will go to those finals as the Western Cape champions. Congratulations to the two teams, Steenberg High for winning here today, and to this both, both of you will go through to the national final. You have exactly one month to prepare for the finals.
They also pick up the 100,000 rand check, courtesy of proud sponsors Sunlum. We spend a little good idea of our money, and we don't spend it on 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 spiali. I think we can better do a swar of it back to come as you after us in. I think in the future we must move for better on that. When we can't just go after loop and then go back to that, we can't just go back. But I think we should have done a good job with the attack today. Yeah, I'm very delighted to have Solvoe again. My teammates played as a. They were very focused and stayed disciplined. And we fought hard to win this tournament. Guys were a bit tired, but we gave it our all and we showed character. My goalkeeper was awesome. He should get goalkeeper of the tournament. My goalkeeper was awesome. He kept a clean sheet since his previous tournaments. He should be called up to some teams who scout him. He's very talented. With all the regional finals completed, the Sunlum came at Sepe Cup, travels to Bloemfontein for the national finals where one lucky team will walk away with the grand prize of one million rand. We'll see you there.